I guess, officially welcome to the vlog. Obviously, it's way later, it's dark out, we're about to leave for dinner, but I have just been working on my computer all day, so that's why I didn't vlog since my workout, but I just think my outfit is so fun. Honestly, these jeans are like a little baggy for like a Friday night dinner look, like they're a little, <laughs> Like too casual I feel like I don't know maybe I should have gone with like tater jeans But I love this bodysuit that I got recently from revolve like I love the buttons my jackets Aritzia my jeans are actually nasty gal just normally I wear them with like sneakers and like a sweatshirt or something But yeah these boots I've been waiting to wear I think they're so cute They are I got them at Nordstrom Rack. I think they're Steve Madden. This is me showing some skin <laughs> Max looks so cute I love when you dress up. This is like once in a blue moon. Yeah. Like jeans I, for him. Yeah, is dressing up the jeans. Hello. So this is the full look everyone in this cutie. What is the word I'm looking for? Not beige, not white. In between, in between color bag, so. Saturday morning. I'm sorry I barely vlogged yesterday, Friday night, because I don't know if you can tell, but I actually was feeling very unwell. Like, I just did not. Hi, Brody. <laughs> He's so sleepy. Sorry, I'm getting distracted. Um, I just did not feel well. If you could tell that clip I was filming before dinner, I had such a bad headache. Like, I don't know why it was so random. My head was like pounding. Maybe it was because I was really hungry, because honestly, after I ate a lot of food at dinner, I felt better. So, yeah, all you guys saw so far was our little walk yesterday morning. He's so sleepy. <laughs> um, a little bar action, our little Friday night date night. Oh, and then you saw that little bar clip from this morning. We did another little chase bar class. Anyway, I just showered and got ready. Well, I guess got a little bit ready at least. I'm in a sweatshirt and leggings and sneakers. <laughs> Look at this guy. Can you even? <laughs> the paw on my leg. But um, I always feel better more put together I've talked about this recently in the video where I was like getting ready and showing you guys my makeup Whenever I put a little bit of makeup on put on my jewelry put on my perfume I always feel a lot better and just more put together even if I'm in like a sweatshirt and leggings And so you guys know orate has my favorite jewelry of all time the majority of my jewelry is from them So I just wanted to remind you guys about them if you haven't heard of them before or if you've been thinking about their pieces for a while so before I forget to mention, I know my code is Gretchen. It will get you 15% off your first purchase on OrateNewYork.com. I will have it linked down below in the description, but they have the best jewelry ever. Their gold just feels so substantial. It's such high quality and it's such a great value for such amazing jewelry. Like all of my rings over here are from Orate. I know this one on my pointer finger I've shown you guys before. There's just little diamonds on it. And then this one right here, actually recently my friend Megan was like, oh my gosh, what is that ring? Is that new? I haven't seen it like I need it it's gorgeous and I'm like it's actually three stacked together so I'll have the names of all the pieces I'm showing you guys listed down below in the description so you can shop the same ones as me if you are interested my earrings are from them shocker they're like these twisty little gold hoops since it's real gold you can shower in it you can sleep in it you can cook in it you can sweat in it like you never have to take it off and they have a lifetime warranty on all their pieces because they know they last oh here you guys this is a lot easier to show you this way and then these these two rings over my ring finger are also orate. I love them, sort of like a chain looking one and then the other little one underneath to stack it with. And I actually have a new collection called the Lioness Collection and I'm freaking out. I'm like screaming a little bit because it's in collaboration with Carrie Washington who I'm just obsessed with. I don't know if you guys love her as much as I do, but scandal anyone? Like, come on, she's incredible. And basically the collection just celebrates women empowerment. I mean, in my mind, all of our rates pieces really do that since they are founded by women. They are sustainable, ethical always. And I actually have my eye on the lioness pendant necklace. I can insert a picture right here so you guys can see what it looks like. I also love the lioness chain necklace. They just have the cutest pieces. So I wanted to make sure I told you guys about that, especially if you love Kerry Washington as much as I 
do. So right now you can check out the Lioness collection and everything else Orate has to offer on their website. You'll get 15% off your first Orate purchase if you go to oratenewyork.com slash Gretchen. Use my promo code Gretchen. You'll get 15% off my favorite jewelry of all time. And if you're one of those DMs that I get being like, oh my gosh, like what's your code or what's that website where you get all your jewelry from? It's Orate. And now I think we're going to have a little Saturday adventure. <laughs> Are you too sleepy to go on our Saturday adventure? It's gonna be so fun you guys. It's his favorite place Well, one of his favorite places. Like he loves the dog park But this Come on Brody, we have so more fun to go wake up. He just wants a belly rub. Are you ready for our adventure? <laughs> I wanted to show you guys my comfy cute outfit. This is from Princess Polly just a black denim jacket This is talentless. I got it in a men's large and it's just like comfy and I love it So neutral black align leggings from Lulu a staple they get some dog hair stuck to them But worth it. They're so comfy and then I didn't even show you these are the Air Max 270s I love these so much. I think they are so cute. You guys ready for how much he loves the car? Oh, I have to fix his little thing. Hop in! Yeah! <laughs> We're all buckled in <laughs> and ready for our Saturday morning Brody Mom Starbucks ride! He loves puppuccinos. They are much better. <laughs> he always needs his window down. Look at this line, you guys. Honestly, it's been way worse, so this isn't even bad at all. And this drive-thru always goes, always goes by so quick. <laughs> this is the funniest thing I've ever seen. I need to take a picture, hang on. I gotta get my mask ready for the drive-thru, of course. And also, I'm hungry. All I ate is a banana. So I think I wanna try those egg bite things. I think I had them like once before forever ago with Louisa. I can't even remember. So I think I want to try those. Obviously getting a vanilla cream cold brew. It's my new fave. And actually I don't think I said this on YouTube yet. But I was telling Max. One of you guys DM'd me that you work at Starbucks. And the reason you think the vanilla cream cold brew doesn't hurt my stomach. Even though there's like cream in there. Is because there's actually very little lactose. Because it's such a high fat like cream or something um so it's really interesting because when i first got it i was like r.i.p my stomach's gonna hurt so bad like i had ice cream last night and my stomach was just killing me i was like not okay when i was trying to go to sleep but yeah whenever i have the vanilla cream cold brew it doesn't hurt my stomach and it just tastes so good so that's what we're getting and then brody is getting a cappuccino that's his regular hey, Kelsey, how are you doing today? good how are you Good, thank you for asking. What can I get for you? Could I do a grande vanilla cream cold brew? And could I also do the bacon egg white bites? Give me one moment to see if we still have them yet. Okay. All right, if you just want one order, you said? Yeah. Could we also do a puppuccino? Yeah, just remind us up at the window then. Okay, thank you. <gasps> Guys, he's starting to realize where we are. <laughs> I feel like he's freaking out. This is like my biggest joy in life, honestly. Seeing Brody get so excited over a puppuccino. Are you so excited? Do you know what's coming? Brody, where are we? <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> no, not yet, not yet, it's coming. I know it's coming, it's coming, I promise. <laughs> Thank you so much. Have a good day. <laughs> <laughs> I always have to pull over immediately, you guys, because he goes crazy. Okay, 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 give me a sec, I'm driving. Here we go. Yeah. Finally. <laughs> oh, yeah. <laughs> it's getting on me. Are you sad now that your puppuccino is gone? It's always like so violent. Like he has to finish it in one second, huh? 
Now I get to try mine. Brody first, always. Oh my God, so good, you guys. I'm not actually exactly sure what's in this. I always just say vanilla cream cold brew. So just say that if you wanna try it. So I think it's cold brew, obviously, with maybe pumps of vanilla flavor and cream. Or is it like a special vanilla cream? I think at first I thought that it was all just one thing that they like pre-make, like vanilla cream cold brew, like it's already like pre-mixed or something. But it must just be vanilla, it must just be the vanilla flavor mixed with cream, mixed with a cold brew. If any of you know, comment down below. Let me know, because I'm not even really sure. But yeah, that was so fun, wasn't it? And they did have egg bites, egg white bites, egg, these have bacon in them. Oh, there's a little, four. oh, <laughs> somebody else wants these. Maybe I'll wait till I'm home to eat those, so that you don't have to watch. Mmm, that was so fun, wasn't it? That was literally so much fun, you guys. And I'm already sad that I didn't get a venti because I drank like most of it on the way home. It's so dang good. But honestly, if I got a venti, I would be like freaking out right now. I'm already like feeling the caffeine, so I don't need the venti. It just tastes so good. Yeah, I picked up some packages on my way in. Oh, this is so exciting. I don't want you to see my address. Yeah, it says my address all over it. Maybe you can just see the top of it. Skins. I got some face masks. I was highly influenced. I forget whose Instagram story it was. I always forget like who I find things through, but basically Skims face masks. They were back in stock and I was like, those are really cute. And if they like are out of stock a lot, like I must need them right now. I figured you can never have too many face masks. Am I right? And nude ones, like I really like my Plain, simple, like all black ones are very neutral ones because they go with more. Oh, these are so cute. Okay, I've definitely seen these all over Instagram. I feel like everyone has these, so now I know. They're the Skims ones, I never knew. And I honestly didn't even think about the fact that they would like make masks. Oh, <laughs> I don't like the ones though where I breathe in. I feel like it's kind of all of them where I'm like, and then I feel like it gets stuck to my nose and I'm like suffocating, but um, yeah, I just have to breathe like lightly. <laughs> These are cute though. Came in a pack of five in case. Later, you guys, we just took Brody on a little sunset walk. If I'm looking like frozen, <laughs> like red right now. Next, I was looking back at vlog footage the other day, and it was after a walk, and I was like, sorry, my face is frozen. It's so cold out, and my face was like bright red from the wind. So, All yeah, crazy. if I look like that. But I told you guys I got packages. Another really exciting one I just picked up. Look at ah! <laughs> a waffle maker, yay! <laughs> I know you're probably like, random, why do you need a waffle maker? I literally ordered this like two days ago, it came so quick, but Max and I were just talking about how we like really wanted a waffle maker and we don't have one, and that it would just be good to make waffles. I feel like I've just been seeing them a lot, like on people's Instagram stories, or you had them at the rink the other day, is that why we were talking about them? Yeah. And so I'm like, okay, I want a waffle. Like I haven't had a waffle in like years. And so literally that day, I looked up waffle makers and I found this one, you guys, that like swivels, like it flip, like the one that we had in our dining hall at BU. So I'm like, okay, I think we need this one. It's kind of like fancy. Got it, Bed Bath & Beyond, if you care. <laughs> I was gonna get it on Target Max, but it said it was gonna come like next week. So then Bed Bath & Beyond, shout out, came in like, Two days. Are you so excited for a wobble? <laughs> Max says, who is it for, me? And I go, kind of all three of us. No, I guess you don't really get a waffle. Were you just trying to eat the cardboard? He was biting it. No cardboard for you. Look at all your toys. <laughs> but I got a bunch of clothes from Revolve. I wanna do a little mini try and haul for you guys, because I got some really cute new stuff. So that's coming up next. I just gotta open up everything, try it on. That's my favorite thing when I get something new in the mail. I feel like that's what everyone does. Like you like rip everything open and try it on right away. So I'm gonna try it on. Good morning, you guys. <laughs> Is it obvious that I had a glass of wine last night, Brody, or several, because um, I need all the liquids this morning. <laughs> you know what I mean? I have a huge thing of liquid IV. I made sure I showed you guys that it was a strawberry flavor. 
because the strawberry flavor is the best by far in my opinion i also really like the lemon lime i feel like that's an unpopular opinion i feel like people don't like that one i've heard like my friends like don't like i'm really i'm just I'm really sorry my hair just needs to not right now um so i have a big water bottle <laughs> my 40 ounce hydro flask is water and then the 32 is the liquid iv i always do more water than it says because i like it more like watered down i don't know and then i have a big huge thing of coffee <laughs> hmm. it's just one of those days brody you know what i mean we went on our big walk thank goodness it's so sunny out i feel like it really helped me just wake up for the day and i guess this was like unintentionally a weekend vlog or maybe it was intentional i don't know and i need to just like get myself together put on some makeup maybe like shower <laughs> and we're just being really real this morning and um i want to show you guys all my new clothes because i was saying i was going to do that and then i was like oh, the lighting isn't good it's dark out already so i figured i would show you guys this morning and it can be fun we can like do this together because i'm just chilling with sleepy brody man max is at the rink he has been at the rink like so much recently like all day long so it's just been like brody me chilling so yeah that'll be fun if we try and close together right but first i'm gonna go like get ready because whenever i get ready i've said this so much recently whenever i get ready put on makeup put my jewelry on everything like that i just feel so much better do my perfume do my hair oh do i wash my hair i don't know like, do you guys ever like like don't know if you're gonna just like throw some more dry shampoo in there even though you've been putting dry shampoo in it for like days or like wash it i would say i'm extremely hygienic with everything other than my hair but i feel like that's normal or like you know how I feel like especially in the past couple years everyone's like oh my gosh it's just bad to wash your hair so much so girls try to like stretch it and do like dry shampoo in between and stuff so I definitely do that but I feel like I shower and brush my teeth and floss and like all those things all the time like I will floss like three times a day so I'm like very clean just my hair and just because I have so much of it like I don't want to deal with it when it's wet because it's like a whole thing but I feel like my air wrap makes it like quicker now to deal with it when it's wet I don't know no one cares. I'm gonna go get ready and then let's try and close. It'll be fun. <laughs> you guys, I can't stop laughing. I'm sorry if you can hear Brody over there chewing on his bone, but all ready. And this first top, how dang cute is this? It's just this gray sweater. I like the neckline in the front. It's kind of like a square neck. And then it ties in the back at the top. Can you see? <laughs> so cute. Love this. I think it's very unique. This is like right up my alley. Basic, but with a little twist. With a tie in the back and the fun little necklace. Do you guys hear that? <laughs> All I can hear is Brody chomping on his bone here. I should just show you. Is that yummy? <laughs> anyway, I realized you guys saw this bodysuit already actually just in black. I got a black one too. And that's what I wore to at dinner on Friday. But then this is just a really pretty... It's showing it more brown on camera, but I feel like it's literally the color of my lips. It's kind of like a taupey, brownish, grayish, purple. Like, I don't even know how to describe this. I think I can't really tell what color it is. But it's really pretty. It's a very unique color. I don't have any, like, color style bodysuit like this. And by the way, this, like, button-up Henley style of top bodysuit is, like, quickly becoming my favorite thing right now. Again, very basic, but with a little twist. I just like the added detail. I'm forgetting some stuff that I have showed before or haven't showed. I don't know if I've showed this, but I know I showed you guys this top in black. It was in my recent like morning routine type of vlog. And I have been living in these tops. If I've showed you before, if I haven't showed you, I've been wearing it a ton. I might've just not vlogged in it. And it's just so soft. Again, the buttons, like I'm really into this style right now. And oh, this is just the best. So of course I had to get it in white. And black. Okay, apparently I'm really into this style. I'm realizing because this is so similar to the top that I just showed you, but it's obviously just like a thicker sweater material, and the other one's just like a thinner long sleeve shirt type of material. But so cute. This type of top goes with like everything I feel like. And this may be the coziest style of sweater. I actually have this in gray already, so of course I had to get it in white. You'll see a common theme that when I really like something, I'll get it in another color. So I had to get the white one. Love it. I love it. It's just like a fresh 
crisp white sweatshirt love the little collar detail so so comfy in this little blouse you guys obviously screams like summer spring i can't wait till it's warm so i can wear this i'm realizing i didn't even <laughs> button the sleeves but how adorable like it's just so girly and dainty like i want to go on a date in this top and this bodysuit i got is so cute you guys i'm screaming i feel like this again is just so different with the buttons and this is just so like feminine and cute to me i mean it's light pink obviously and i just feel like i would wear this for like valentine's day how adorable i also want to say that this is on sale when i got it i may be wrong but i think this is on sale so oh i just love it you guys this like shacket is that what we're calling these nowadays like sweater jacket situation so cute i love the light and dark gray colors i also think it's like a light pink tan stripe so it goes so well with the pink bodysuit that i got like goodbye, I need to go get an Instagram picture in this right now. It's so cute. Then this gray bodysuit is stunning. It's just long sleeve, has a really fun neckline. I feel like I've seen this all over Instagram and now I know why. It's so soft, so adorable. Brody, what are you doing over there? Chewing on the baseboard. <laughs> okay, sorry, I went actually ham, but this is the second to last thing, promise. I saw this sweater on Revolve for so long, you guys. It's just obviously this tan sweater that's a little bit extra, a little fun with the ruffles. I love the mock neck detail, is that what it's called? Not cowl neck, I always mess up the necks. It's not a turtleneck, not a, I don't know, in between. You know, like a little like halfway up her neck. Anyway, <laughs> I didn't realize how sparkly it would be in person, like the material. I didn't know it was like a sparkly material. I thought it was just plain. So that makes it even more fun, a little more fancy. Last but not least, just a casual little zip up. I actually went a size up in this just so it would, you know, be a little more looser, flowy up top. Just extra comfy, I feel like. I realize I have like no zip up sweatshirts and I needed some. I just feel like I would wear them a lot and you can throw them over things. They're not as hard to put on as like a hoodie. I don't know. <laughs> I don't know why I don't own zip up sweatshirts. So yeah, love this. And maybe I need some like long ones next because it's obviously like cropped. So yes, that is all the clothes I got. Thank you for bearing with me. I know I went a little shopaholic, a little crazy. I feel like this vlog is getting so long, you guys. So I'm just going to end it off here. Thank you so, so much for watching and I will see you in my next video.